What up guys, good morning. I am knocking out some client work, editing a video here at home. Since I got this MacBook Pro, I've been kind of balancing being at home and at the campus a lot better. So I can knock out work here whenever that's kind of like time sensitive, you know, like new programs. Like I want to get those to my clients right away and not have them wait until I get to the campus at my desk. So this is working out really well to chill at home and work and sip on my coffee. I hit a new low this morning. Let me see. Yesterday was a high weigh in and this morning was nice. So Wednesday was 173 and then Thursday, yesterday 174.3. So there was a fluctuation. And then this morning 172.2, but I took a good shit. Keep in mind, your shits are gonna freaking make your, your, your weight fluctuate also. There's too many variables, your water, uh, your digestion. Just keep in mind that this trend is what matters the most. So don't stress the daily weigh-ins. So 172.2, I'm progressing. I'm, I'm dropping a good amount of weight every week, which is my intention. I want to get this cut going, get past this in-between stage where I just look soft and I'm counting macros every day, I'm in a deficit, but it, it takes a certain time frame to get past that hump where you look harder and leaner. You just have to stay patient. Mmm, smells so good. So I'm just making some breakfast burritos. These tortillas are freaking great. If you have trouble getting your fiber in, this is like a high fiber tortilla wraps. I think it's... It's 11 grams of fiber per tortilla. Gram and a half of fat, 16 carb, and four protein. Baby Raymond's um, bulk is going good. <laughs> How many weeks do you have left? Five. 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 So if you guys missed it, we got our boy. And we're done. And we're naming him Raymond. Because if you guys didn't know, I'm Raymond Jr. And I always said that if I had a boy, it would be Raymond the third. What are you wearing? It is way too nice outside. It's like 80 degrees for me not to ride, so I'm riding. Let's hear purr. It's been a while. It's been a couple weeks. It feels so good. I got a lot of shit done today. All my client work is done. I edited up a YouTube video for you guys. I'm gonna end up having to train on my own today. Everybody uh, can't make it at the same time. Everyone um, train earlier or will tra is training later. Uh, so I'm gonna get hit a solo workout. Hopefully I have my beats in my backpack. The only time I like wearing headphones is when I'm training solo. But when I have partners, I think, I don't know, it's just, it's not necessary, it's rude to your workout partners. I think you're there as like a, a, a unit, right? Like you have to, everyone's running off the same energy. And if you're like in your own zone, then it doesn't, there's no point of having workout partners, right? Yeah, so I'm gonna knock out a pool day. No more conventionals. And we haven't been doing sumos either. But I think everybody's missing it and everyone's lower back is like recovered from months and months of deadlifting. 
it was a nice change up and right now i have the itch to just bring back the bodybuilder in me so that's like lower rep sets focused on strength and just more hypertrophy and chasing the pump Trip, guys it's legal to land split in california that's why it's the only state i would live in right now yeah when i was in texas it sucked ass because i saw people on bikes sitting in the traffic in the heat like i'm not talking like this kind of traffic i'm talking like stop and go traffic and they had to wait in line because it's illegal to lane split over there one thing that's crazy is uh helmets are like optional in Texas. Saw a couple guys on the freeway with no helmet. It was that was a trip. Oh man, I miss riding. It's warm today. It's so nice. Look at how clear the sky is. Yeah, I don't know what I would do if I couldn't filter up like this. Because on a bike, you don't want to be in congestion and traffic. You're more prone to fucking getting hit by somebody not looking and misses you. I ride very, very defensive. And I'm always, like right here off the light, like all speed to get to make space from the cars behind me. And then I cruise. <laughs> I'm going to tell anybody that wants to ride, just take the class and ride, because it's, it, it's an indescribable feeling being on a bike, being on two wheels. Every aspect of it, the bikes, you know, uh, the cornering, the power, the speed, it's so fun. I think I may like it equal equally to uh fitness see my eyes oh my god it's so nice outside so can you see my eyes <laughs> Calvin's are here so guys I have been wearing briefs like Calvin Klein briefs for like over how long since we've been together yeah like over five years it's just I, I was able to wear them and be comfortable with them because bodybuilding posing trunks but I always tried different boxer briefs, but I couldn't find anything that was comfortable with the size of my legs, my quads, and my tight-fitting pants. I found these ones. I seriously have tried everything. I just found these Calvin Klein ones, and I bought a couple in Texas, and they're just crazy, crazy comfortable. They're a little pricey, but they're worth it. I found them Calvin Klein Body Modal. Model. No. Model. There's an A. Modal. Modal. Okay. We're French now? Yeah. See, so you're speaking French now? I'm dead stocking for me? I'll do the unboxing. You can lick your own juice. <laughs> Take a guess what they are, guys. I've been on my shoe game lately. It's because there's been a lot of heat that has been dropping from Nike. Like, they are stepping it up finally. For a while, there was nothing that I liked. I remember when we used to go to Foot Locker and stuff? For all the shoe stores, when we go like, to the mall and we didn't find anything? Like, we'd walk in and out. Woo! Another pair of vapor masks. Nice. 
someone's gonna comment, you're gonna kiss your wife after you do that? Yeah. Like, shut the hell up. One of those guys that's afraid of um, aspartame, artificial sweeteners, diet sodas. Hippies. <laughs> Just call them hippies. And I am done. I have spent the last three hours knocking this ebook out that I announced on Instagram. I call it Fitness 101. It's pretty much a short and sweet, super simple, straight to the point guide for fitness. You know, whether you're, you're bulking or cutting, I talk about macros, I talk about training, I talk about progressive overload, I talk about goal setting, everything's in there. But it's very simplified. Everything is based on science, but I'm not drowning you with all the science bullshit, right? Me, personally, I like reading, I like re doing research, I like seeing research, but the whole, like, drowning you with the science part of fitness is not me. It's just not me. I'm not that sciencey guy. If you guys are interested, I'm working on putting this up in the store, so by the time you guys see this, this video is up, I'll have it in my store. The link to Fitness 101 is in the description, so click that and let me know how you guys like it. All right, I got my legend going. About to start sipping on this. I, I really need it because uh, I'm pretty tired. It's pretty late, seven o'clock. I almost don't want to train. I just want to go home. Man, downloads are going off. I think there's over 500 downloads of my uh, Fitness 101 ebook, so definitely, guys, get it. Um, I'm already getting feedback through my DMs on Instagram saying that um, very helpful information was straight to the point and very useful. That's a wrap guys, short quick workout, I gotta get over to Apple. I ordered a um, Apple TV 4K. I still have the old ass Apple TV from like, I don't know, I think four or five years ago. So it only plays 1080 and we have a 4K TV, which is kind of shitty. We're kind of cutting ourselves short, not being able to you know, watch the 4K movies because I buy a lot of movies on iTunes and those come 4K and when we watch them on the old Apple TV, no 4K, just 1080. I uh, got through that workout pretty quick, and that's what you gotta do sometimes. Sometimes you just don't wanna be in there. Just get something in and move on. Leg day, guys. Leg day solo, my pre-workout carbs right now. I gotta get this done because uh, me and the girls, and I think my boy Roger is gonna meet us. We're gonna go get uh, sushi. All you can eat sushi. It's to the point in, in my cut where I feel like I, it's beneficial for me to have a weekly uh, refeed. Once per week, just once per week, I usually will fast majority of the day, have a little bit of calories early in the day, and then we go have sushi. <laughs>
So no Romelios today. Time to time I like to switch it up and to squat in a flat shoe. And I like doing that because I don't like being reliant on, on squat shoes. I want, I want to make sure my mobility is still up to par that I can squat without squat shoes. So today I'm probably just going to do a quick three sets of like eight on the squat and then I'm going to move on. I'm going to, I'm going to do some sumos today. Talk to the guys and we all agree that we missed the sumo so we're going to bring that back. Dancing. I'm like right there. Fit right here. It's a plain round T. My new Vapor Maxes, some jogger jeans, Apple Watch. Pretty simple. Check these out though, they're so clean. They look even better with jeans, in my opinion. So I'm ready to tear some sushi up. Let's go. Hots are too big. <laughs> Riley, tell them what happened. <laughs> Riley busted out of her uh, tights. Her quads are too big. <laughs> it's just like daddy. You <laughs> too. How many rolls are you gonna eat? Four. How many are you gonna eat, Kendall? One. Two. Two? How, my, how many am I gonna eat? Probably like 10. How many are you gonna eat, Big Mama? Three. I started calling her Big Mama because she's um, <laughs> pregnant and she's the boss. Last time we were at sushi, Riley uh, told the waitress, waitress was giving, um, the waitress was giving her sushi and Riley was like, those are for Big Mama. <laughs> yeah. So be careful what you tell your kids. <laughs> Remember that, Riley? Mm -hmm. You're crazy. Arashi. Where are we? Uh, Arashi. What is it? Is it Arashi? Yeah. Because I'm going to tell you guys my character. Kendall, you're, you're gonna go in there. You're going down, Kendall. <laughs> what? Where do you go? Pretty do. Yes. I've been waiting all week for this. I've been waiting all year for this. It's so tasty right now. Mm. It's guys, look at Roger's rocking the uh, all black like 270s. Oh man. Those are so You got a nice. shark and then a hurt. So, there's some hot sake. Hello, Rob just asked me when was the last time I had a IPA. It's been a while. It's been a while. I'm trying to get to that like next level where I'm like already. <laughs> Chris Jones says we're trying to get bro ready. Bro ready. Bro ready. Okay. Yeah. You know, like. Oh, it looks good. That's yeah, a, it, it is that's a big boy. It's large. It looks a little strong. Okay. Oh, yeah, man. but it's good. <laughs> it's very hot. Oh. Uh, uh, I need. Uh, What's your driving? 
Am I quiet today? Yeah, you're, we have <laughs> DDs. Yes. Cheers. Cheers. This is for Roger's birthday. Your birthday was last week, right? Last oh, week, we're in Texas? On the 5th. On the 5th. Cheers. How old are you, sure? 27. 27. Yeah. <sighs> Sake is just rice, just carbs, guys. It's natural. Yeah. You're going to crush it. <laughs> So the girl sushi just came. Salmon. Mm. This is the last one. Oh my god. Roger, I'm going to eat one, two, three. Go, let me see, Riley. Let me, let me see, Riley. Hey, eat this one. Crush it. <laughs> just like daddy, huh? <laughs> oh my god. Not, nothing close to 50, but. Nothing close. Gotta do it. <laughs> I was always craving sushi. He talks about it and then he makes me crazy. <laughs> Cheers. Dad? Um, I'm not going to I got 20 pieces of We got the last can. It's crunched out before. Roll. Hawaiian. Oh. I have a stall. I have a stall. I'm one done. I'm pretty good. I think I have another couple rolls, but. Like the, oh, the, oh, yeah. but the their hair never fell out. Like you know, like on the back when they're sleeping, yeah. Last they never, yeah, it didn't. And then, like I'm not physically full, but I'm like satisfied. My, yeah, they were all satisfied. I'm good, and it's because this cut has been very gradual and slow, and my leptin levels are still pretty good. The second that you get to that point where you like, like, want to binge like you're in that binge pr yeah. prone mode it means your 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 diet's too aggressive or you're like super super deep into a cut right now i'm like early on i'm still higher in body fat like i'm good where are we at at mall at the mall at the mall because it's my favorite part your favorite all right so we are at the mall um riley needs some shoes and some clothes She's growing. All right, guys, I want to say thank you for watching the vlog. As always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. You go, I go, you stay, I stay. One song, you sing.